playing against Tottenham Hotspur, I just told the story actually to, to John as well. So uh, we had a superstition on the bus that we would play whatever music or video that we that we do before games that we won. They won the three previous games. So and the thing that they were playing, if anyone has seen this, Faulty Towers. There's an episode in the Faulty Towers uh, about the Germans. All right, and we were watching it and this and that. Now all throughout that game, they were calling me an Aussie this and Aussie that, and seeing you and things the same. So I and remember this for later on in the story, right? So I just as this. Doing that, I thought, don't buy, don't buy. And they're thinking about Jurgen Klinsmann. I just went, I did, I didn't do it. I just went like this, like, which is the one from Basil Fawlty, right? <laughs> Remember with which hand I did it because it was important to the end of the story. So anyway, there was like, it was like a rule that somebody scored, you know. The lines were flagged. The referee came over and booked me. I said, what are you booking me for? And he said, well, racial excitement. I said, what are you on about? I said, I was only messing around, and he pulled me close on the pitch. This very rarely happens. He said, Mark. I have to tell you, there's a massive portion of Jewish support here at Tottenham Hotspur. I just went, oh my God. Right, so straight after the game, we lost the game. And as the manager, it was a very nice fan, Brian Little was going around. He was actually, he turned around and he said, don't, I don't want to be bothered by anybody. And our kid man came up to him as he was about to say to me, he said, actually, boss, he said, today, because he didn't see the incident. He said, today you've done very well. As he's saying that the kid man's gone, boss, and he's gone, Jim, I told you, don't bother me. He said, boss, there's police outside. I want to speak to, to Bossy, that's the to call me in England. So the police came in, arrested me and so forth. Um, big, big trouble. 15, normally the, after a Premier League game, it's probably about 15 to 20 press people, depending on who you play. There was about 60 outside. So I just went outside, explained exactly what I just said to all you guys, profusely apologised, uh, rang up uh, Radio 5 Live, which is, say, like a Triple M or, or a 2GB here in Sydney who do the live games. Uh, apologised, went on TV the next day, apologised, and then um, spoke to my dad and turned around and said, look, if you want to, your mum and sister don't want to speak to you, um, and, he, and he said, and, and so far as I'm concerned, if you want to do something stupid again, fine, but change your name. <laughs> <laughs> so then we, we had to go to the hearing. My agents were Jewish, my lawyer was Jewish, so I had to explain to all of them as well. Okay, so they were all like, okay, we'll take your side of the story. Anyway, that week, I actually got a letter from a chap who was in the parachute regiment um, during the Second World War, who had been evacuated from Dunkirk, who also partaken in D-Day, and he wrote to me saying, look, I take your word for it, I think it's a load of crap, you know, blah, blah, this is political correctness going absolutely crazy. And he said, and by the way, he said, tell them at the hearing, he said that if they ask, if they get a really pedantic with you at the hearing, just tell them that in Hitler's army, if you did the salute with the wrong arm, with this arm, that that was, or could be, a shooting offence, or they put you in like a, a, a camp, basically, as a prisoner of war, or as a political prisoner, and we used to do it to take the, the mickey out. So of course, during this hearing, it started to go against me a little bit, but I, I, so I just sort of stood up like a little bit like Tom Cruise from, you know, that few men. And I said, you can, yeah. I said, of course, Everyone knows, you know, everyone knows that if you do it with this opposite arm, it's an insult. Doesn't that the case? So there you go. So I hope that answers your question.